Prior to the 1990s, organic food represented a small-scale market, a market with laudable goals, but with fringe appeal. But all that was to change when in 1993, Nell Newman launched Newman's Own Organics, a brand that would bring organic food into the mainstream. My motivation for starting Newman's Own Organics was to support organic agriculture and be able to um, donate money to charity. I think it's. I think we've really moved on to the mainstream. You know, we're uh, we've had 20 percent. We've had double-digit growth for over 20 years now. So I think it's really gone beyond the fringe, the little wrinkled apples in the health food store, to the point where there really isn't anything you can't find organic. Being ahead of the curve often means there are many people you have to persuade along the way. For Nell, that meant starting with her father, actor Paul Newman. And I made his 100% organic Thanksgiving dinner, very traditional, you know, turkey with peas and um, stuffing and mashed potatoes and pumpkin pie. And when he finished wiping his plate clean, I said, so, how'd you like your organic Thanksgiving dinner? And he got it. And so that was his, that was his aha moment. Just as Paul was won over by Nell's Thanksgiving dinner, Newman's Own Organics has since shown the world that organic and sustainably grown food is not only better for the planet, it tastes good. The misconception used to be that organic was, um, you know, funny looking and wrinkled and didn't taste good. And that is, is completely changed. Organic produce looks beautiful, tastes good, that's why chefs use it. She launched her brand with a humble offering of organic pretzels. Today, Newman's Own Organics has grown to a line of 160 products. To witness how it's made organic mainstream, look no further than the 650 McDonald's, which now serve Newman's Own Organic Free Trade Coffee to customers throughout New York and New England. And they haven't forgotten our four-legged friends. Nell attributes her love of nature and interest in health to the values instilled by her parents. I discovered at about age 11 that the peregrine falcon was extinct east of the Mississippi due to the use of DDT. And that was a really eye-opening experience for me. I was definitely a budding biologist when I was young. After earning a Bachelor of Science from the College of the Atlantic, Nell transformed those values into working with numerous conservation organizations, saving peregrine falcons, reintroducing bald eagles in California, and creating the Nell Newman Foundation that continues her father's legacy of giving to great causes. I really thought what Dad was doing was fantastic. You know, that it was really for the philanthropy, and I just love that concept. I really wanted to follow in his footsteps, but I wanted to do it a little differently and do it by supporting organic agriculture. For building on a legacy and transforming an industry, we salute Nell Newman.